Hey everybody, it's Neil. Check out what I have here. I have a ski bag made by Bisco and the ski boot bag. It says it's the cover they put it in black instead of black, but I'll show you guys what it looks like here. I'm gonna try to put some boots in it and show you how it works. Let me just move some of this other stuff out of the way. Okay, so here is the bag. And it looks like a good traditional boot bag here. So let me go and aim y'all down a little bit and we'll try to fill it up a little bit and we'll see how it looks. Let's move it back. And there, I think you can see it here. Okay, so it's got the straps, traditional. That's a traditional look here. Let me open this up. Sorry, I'm working with a thumb that I got really hurt. But, so here's the back section where we can put our boots. I don't have ski boots. I usually end up renting them because I'm traveling uh, usually. But I have some, just some heavy duty boots that I have, some my winter boots that I'll use. And you can see there's plenty of space in there. I could actually fit a whole other set of boots probably in there, yeah. I can put two sets of boots in here instead of one. Look at that. So those are usually the boots I'll travel with. Some for outside, some for inside. And there we go. So that would zip up there. So there is our, our first section full. We have a couple of sections over here. Let's see this. We have a top section, a front section. Let's see what this front section looks like here. So we have our front section. We can put some stuff in there. If I'm going to put some, my, what is this here? I have a, I think a little heated, oh, here are some gloves with some little battery powered gloves that I have. Oh, actually, these are just my ski gloves, right? Just so wanting ski gloves. So yes, I'll put my ski gloves up front. Why not? Then you've got all these different sections. I, I know some people will pack it a certain way, but me, I don't have too much preference. We have a top section here with a good size cavity, so there I'll put my helmet, my ski helmet, in there. And I can even probably fit my goggles here. These are my goggles. I still have the tag on them, how funny. I've worn them, I guess I just don't take the tag off the backs. So there we go, so now we have that section full. We have these side sections here. Uh, looks like we have ability to clip on some uh, ski poles or stuff on the sides here. We can even clip gloves, and if we have gloves, we could wrap those around uh, here. There is a zipper section right here too. Let's see what this one looks like here. We have a little section, that's, like, that's pretty deep. I could probably put my gloves. Actually, I put the gloves in the front. I have so many different pairs of gloves. Put some gloves there. Some I have heated socks and stuff. I can put those in the sides. I can clip things on. And look at all that space you have here on one here. And in the back, we have a little place here. We can put our little uh, business card. So if we lose it, we have access to it. And then there is a little zipper section up top here too. So we can put, it's, it's like soft inside. It's like a velvety one. That's probably where I would want to put the goggles if I don't have them in a case. So that's that. Lots of places here to strap on carabiners or hang stuff from front and back here. And, um, and even the sides here to hook on poles and skis and whatnot. Let's try this on. Oh, actually, if you look at this here, it's got like little nubs for, um, for comfort, hopefully. <laughs> Make it kind of padded. What am I stuck to? Oh, I'm stuck to a balloon. Okay, but here we go. And so, there we go. Now I have it on. And so this is how it fits. It's got a little chest clip here too, which makes it nice and easier, a little bit more comfortable. So there we go. So now this is what it looks like we're in it. And with boots and everything else in there, it's not gonna be super heavy. It's not a super heavy duty, but it's super comfortable. So I'm gonna say this is a really nice uh, ski boot bag. It's got a lot of stuff on it. It's not gonna be the largest of bags. You won't be able to fit everything in the world necessarily in it. There goes the balloon. Uh, but it'll fit a lot of stuff in there uh, nonetheless. And then hold it like this, hold it like this. However, when you're doing it, it's great because then once you get to the ski area, you can just pop this down even in the snow. It's got this plasticky kind of bottom on it, so it won't uh, soak in the wet. It all kind of feels fairly water uh, tight too. So I'm gonna say it's a really nice looking bag. And it's even got little breathable areas here, so your skis can air out a little. So I'm gonna say this is a really great bag. Very cool. So thumbs up for sure. Like it.